All right, Rob here from MyPPCTraining.com, and in today's video, I'm going to walk you through a really cool tool called AdWords Keyword Wrapper, made by Michael Wong, this guy right up here. Thanks, buddy. Appreciate it. And how you use this tool to build out all of your ad groups and keywords. So you should be logged into your Google AdWords account, obviously, if we're working out of AdWords. And in today's video, I'm going to walk you through how to use all the different keyword match types and how to, how to do them and use this really cool tool and how to do them for you so you don't have to manually put brackets and phrases and plus signs around all your stuff because that's a huge pain in the ass and nobody wants to do that. And you'd be surprised people still do that. <laughs> so the first things first, the tool we're going to be using is called AdWords Wrapper. It's up here. You can see AdWordsWrapper.com made uh, by this guy, Michael Wong. And um, it's it's a free tool. It's, it's awesome. Okay, so it's definitely something you should use to build out your ad groups, your with your keyword different keyword match types. So if you watched any of our previous videos, you should know that the three match types we recommend that you use when starting out a campaign and nothing else is just exact match, exact match, phrase match, and modified broad match. Okay. Now this tool is going to do that for you. So let's say you we'll go into our campaign, go under ad groups, and these are all our ad groups for our campaign that we're running. So let's say under this ad under this ad group, we have we found a shitload of keywords um, that don't that don't have match types right now. Okay, so we just went into the keyword planner, we built out this massive list of all these awesome keywords we want to do for this ad group. So instead of going through each keyword and putting a bracket or a phrase around them or a plus sign or whatever. What we're going to do is drop that list right into here. All right, so let's actually go through and create a list just so you can see what I'm talking about. So this is, and guys, I'm just adding a bunch of random shit, so don't hold me to it. All right, so let's say that these are the keywords we want to add. And remember, keep in mind, any keywords you add to an ad group must be very tightly themed to what the ad group is, the ads in that ad group, and the landing page is going to. Can't stress that enough. All right, so we got our keywords. Go into the wrapper here, drop them in, hit wrap keywords. Now it's going to wrap them in all the different match types. And these are three that you want to be using in your ad groups. Stay away from broad match. I can't stress that enough, if, especially if you're new to AdWords. Just it's you're going to get killed with it, so just don't even bother. You can do modified broad phrase and exact, and just what you would do is just copy, just copy them. Then come back over into your ad group. Make sure you're in your ad group that you want to be in. You can see on this side down here, we're in that group we want to be in. You would hit the plus sign, paste, save, and that would add all those to this ad group with the match types. All right, super super easy. I can't stress it enough. Great tool. Now let's say that you just want to do phrase and exact match. You come down here or broad phrase and exact match, which you know don't ever use broad, but just my opinion or just phrase match, or just modified broad, or just exact. So there's a lot of different options here that it gives you of how to add into your ad groups and, and what uh, uh, keyword modifiers to use. So this is a pretty cool, pretty cool tool. Let me know if you guys use this. Drop some questions in the comments below the video. Other than that, um, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Give me a thumbs up on this video. Share it, please. Get it out there. A lot of people don't use, they still use Excel to do all this stuff, and that's like ridiculous. So. Other than that, I will see you in our Facebook group or in the next video.